everyone welcome to my channel it's Maria today we are making a fall flower pickup truck let's get to it okay we're gonna start by taking the stickers off of the pickup trucks I got these at the Dollar Tree um, and these aren't the wood ones these are more like a thick I would say like a thick cardboard um, but yeah they did have the wood ones but I didn't want to use the wood ones I wanted to use this one because um, I don't know I think this is the one that I picked out for what I wanted to do the wood one I don't know I just didn't like it too much um, but anyway I ended up getting that um, and the fabric I also got at the Dollar Tree this is one of the colors that I am incorporating in my fall decor this year so I grabbed the fabric and I'm going to cut some pieces off of it I'm gonna trace the pickup truck just the back part of the pickup truck not the whole pickup truck um, I thought about it, but since I'm putting some words on here later, um, I did a project before where so I did the fabric and you couldn't see the words that I put. So I didn't like it, didn't want to put the fabric all over. Um, but anyway, I cut out the pieces and I'm going to use Bohemian Blue um, by DIY Paints. Um, I've been using these paints a lot. I get them from... A fellow youtuber um, her name is Sammy her YouTube page is unicorn dust designs she has a lot of DIY paints um, that I get from her but um, this is I saw this color and I really wanted to do something with it so I painted the truck this color um, I am using my paint palette this time um, I am <laughs> putting my colors on here so I don't have to dig into um, dip into the lid or whatever um, but I am using it I do make a big mess later but you will see later on in the video so keep watching <laughs> The pickup truck is done um, both of them um, as you can see they're opposite sides because I am putting them side by side and now I'm doing the crate um, the same color <laughs> Okay, so now while the crate dries, I am going to get my Mod Podge and I'm going to flip my fabric on the back of the pickup truck. So I do brush the Mod Podge on the truck and then I put the fabric on and I add some more Mod Podge on top of that. <music> Okay, so now I'm gonna add the big top on the paint 
because that's what's going to give my paint the shine. I don't want it to, um, cause it looks a little dry, but it's okay. Don't worry about it. I like the color. Um, but the big top will make it pop more, like pop a little bit more. So give it that shine and it looks a lot better. Um, so I'm going to do that to the pickup truck and I'm going to do it to the crate because even though some of the crate is going to be covered, I still want that paint to shine through. Now I'm painting my words. Um, this says Farm Fresh. This was a set, I believe, of four um, from the Dollar Tree and I'm painting it and I felt like the color just blended right in with the wood color so I added a little bit of the bohemian blue and mixing it with that color actually came out really really nice so I did add that um, on there and I put it on top of the paper towel because I felt like it was a little too dark but I put it on there and actually gave it a really nice color it did not blend in with the truck which was perfect um, and then I also put Big Top on top of that as well. Um, that way it can also give it that shine. So here I am going to use my hot glue gun to glue the crate to the back part of the pickup truck. Um, I make sure that it's lined up right, um, but I do that with both sides. After gluing the crate on there and putting it together, um, and checking it out making sure everything was right i did not like that i didn't do the inside of the truck so i went back and painted the inside of the truck <laughs> so the bohemian blue is on the inside and on the outside so both sides are painted um and then i add my words which is says farm fresh Okay, so once I'm done doing that and I like I painted it, I put the words in and stuff. Um, I put the styrofoam in. Now it didn't fit at first, so I did have to cut it to size. And then I use the hot glue gun and put some glue inside. And then I just add the styrofoam in. Once I'm done that, I love putting flowers anywhere. So I just, I don't know, I just like that part. So <laughs> that was the fun part for me was putting the flowers inside the back of the truck onto the styrofoam. flowers these are the flowers that I picked out for um, to add to the truck um, I some of them I had from last year that I never used and some of them I picked up this year um, at the Dollar Tree I really like the colors that, that I had because I never really incorporated the blue into my fall decor but I felt like this color just really came out to me and it was like talking to me so I don't know I liked it um, but I'm glad that I added it because it turned out really really nice um, but I hope you guys like this video. Thanks for watching. There are more videos to come with fall decor, epoxy, and more woodcrafts. So keep watching. Um, and please like and subscribe for more. Thank you. Bye.